the security record of President François Hollande's government is under intense scrutiny over the murder of a priest in northern France. One of the attackers was supposed to be under tight surveillance after two attempts to reach Syria. French Prime Minister Manuel Valls has admitted the French justice system failed. He told newspaper Le Monde Adèle Kermish's house arrest with electronic monitoring was initially ordered by a magistrate specialising in jihadism cases and confirmed by three experienced appeals court judges. We must recognise the failure. Nicolas Sarkozy, President Hollande's predecessor and potential opponent in next year's election, has seized on the situation, calling for stronger measures to track down and detain known Islamist sympathisers. But this pundit says that won't work. The government has locked itself into a repetition of what it has already done, that is, more state of emergency, more soldiers, more bombing against Raqqa or Mosul. Uh, uh, these three things didn't work in the past. Uh, it is unlikely that they're going to work much better uh, in the future. As for the opposition, it does tend to prefer uh, grandstanding and putting forward a, a rather extravagant uh, measures like uh, uh, putting in retention camps just about anybody who has ever come to the notice of the police. Prime Minister Valls also dismissed the idea. He said, we should do anything that leads to better security, but there's a line we can't cross, the rule of law. Detaining people on suspicion alone is morally and legally unacceptable and wouldn't be effective. My government won't be the one that creates French-style Guantanamo centres. The Prime Minister said the government has a strategy to defeat Islamic totalitarianism. It involves, he said, a revolution in our security culture but difficult to see what will work against radicalised youths like the second church attacker who has no criminal record and despite being French-born spoke in a video about destroying your country. State of emergency is uh, intrinsically a bad idea uh, because it simply pushes the terrorists into deeper uh, cover, uh, clandestinity. They adapt quite well to states of emergency. Surveillance, yes, but we should not kid ourselves uh, the only way to try to uh, preempt the sorts of things which happened in France or in Germany very recently or in Belgium will require much more massive surveillance of society in general and not simply of would-be perpetrators. A French parliamentary report earlier this month called for a major overhaul of the country's intelligence services with better coordination and sharing of information. And as the Prime Minister warned, this war will be long and we will be subjected to other attacks.